Hi, welcome to GovGig Academy. First off, thanks very much for spending some time with us today. As always, our goal is to give you the tools you need to better understand the often complex and sometimes even daunting world of federal construction contracting. By the end of this training, we're confident this is gonna be time well spent. I'm Jeremy Weichel, and I've had the privilege of working with people just like you in the other GovGig Academy trainings. Today, we're gonna to change things up a bit, though. It's not just gonna be me talking. Today, I'm here with our guest presenter, Mr. Terry Homburg. Terry and I are gonna go through the training discussing some specific aspects of the WAF program. WAF is Wide Area Workflow. I met Terry about 15 years ago when I was brand new to federal construction contracting. I've gotten to work with, and even better, learn a lot from Terry over the years. Terry's been in federal service now for 39 years, and for 29 of those 39 years, he's been in federal construction contracting at all levels of contract administration. He's a wealth of knowledge, and we're lucky to have him here on the team at GovGig. Today, like I said, Terry's gonna be talking with us about Wide Area Workflow, or WAF. We'll give a brief overview of Wide Area Workflow and why it's important, because WAF is how federal contractors actually get paid for their work. We'll also be looking at the WAF contract clause later in the training. You'll be able to follow along with us by downloading the three handouts. After you download the three handouts, Click on the next video and we'll get started with Wide Area Workflow.